the sun really isn't my friend today it's all over the place it's like putting loads of glare on me but i did notice that i have i put this dress on and i realized i have a pleasure that pretty much matches this dress so i brought it over to sit with me anyway today is build a bear day <laughs> finally get to open these so these are some more halloween babs they got released after the sanrio build a bears and after pumpkin kitty who's over there now because i want her away from me but they did give me a partial refund for her and then i had a bunch of points from the previous orders which meant i could get a bunch of stuff for free i have a birth certificate with october 31st as the birthday because all my halloween plushies are going to be born on halloween <laughs> okay so first on top is the full-sized plush i did get the what do they call it? The axolotl, I think they call it. So this is the glow in the dark axolotl. Some people say that it feels weird, but it doesn't. It feels all right. It feels like the, the peeps. And there was something else that had this feeling to it. And I can't remember what it was. But it doesn't feel weird. It feels fine. So this is now my third axolotl. I have the lavender one and I have the festive one. I also do have a little axolotl lavender mini bean. I had the pink one as well, but I gifted that to my daughter. So here he is. I will show you these glowing later. Right now it is so, so bright. Earlier when it was raining and it was really gloomy looking and now it's really, really bright. And I'm losing my voice. I have been for a few days now. But yeah, I didn't get a cent in it because I didn't want to spend any more money. I wanted it to be as cheap as possible, this order. So it's just the glow. I think the glow is plenty, you know. I'm not going to be really cuddling this that much. It's going to be sat with my other axolotls and it can glow on the top. I really like this, actually. I really, really like it. And I like that I have a purple and a green axolotl now because purple and green are my favourite colours. Purple first, always. And and then green this is like a really kind of um nuclear kind of green it's a really fun green let's sit him here you can just like peek a little bit or should we get him a little bit higher there we go then oh my favorite thing in the whole box i can see him looking up at me but he could be last out of the box because everyone else is on top so next i got the little bear clops mini bean i've seen the full size one but i think i prefer the mini bean his best if it gets a little bit bent up and it says bear clops wishing you an awesome day so there he is he is really sweet little beanie let's sit him on the axolotl the axolotl i swear that's what they call it i like his little eyebrow that's like extra material that flaps over <laughs> He looks really sweet. When I first saw him on the site, that's the thing that I kind of thought, oh, I hope that actually is something that is like over top of his eye because it's a really cute idea. Sit in there. I don't think he glows at all. I think he should though. And then I have the pumpkin glow bear mini bean i like the full size of this as well but i also i, I do have a pumpkin glow bear from last year i kind of prefer the glow and dark one because this one obviously has batteries <laughs> he's, he's still working he's fine i will need to take a bit of video after this video so you guys can see everyone glowing and lit up but this one apparently only its ears glow which i feel is a shame i feel that the whole face should glow but apparently only the ears glow it says on the description that his ears glow i like it it's a little leaf on his head i do like the little leaf detail that they have on them i think this is really really cute so we'll see how well they glow when the sun goes down let's see what his birth certificate says pumpkin bear wishing you all the gourd vibes this autumn all the gourd vibes and then finally the only squishes so far that i have been fully in love with the now that i have this one and because i don't feel the need to have a bunch of squishes my little girl really really likes the dragon fruit one so i'm going to gift her the dragon fruit one as a christmas present this year i just want the zombie bear i love the zombie bear the second i saw it i knew i wanted a zombie bear his little heart is raised up actually that's really cool he feels a little bit wonky but he's absolutely lovely i love this this is it for me i don't think i need any more squishes he's perfect i love the zombie like I said, I liked the dragon fruit, but I got it because it was on offer. I could get it for free in that order. Because it's like if you buy it a full price bear, you get the Scooshie for £10. But then obviously I got the whole order for free because of all the discounts and like voucher codes and stuff I had. So that's the only reason why I got that one. So it was the best of the bunch that they had there. But my daughter really loves the dragon fruit. Now they've released this one, I managed to get it on the same deal where you get it for £10 with a full price bear. So I got this zombie bear Scooshie, which is my absolute favorite i'm in love with it oh my gosh i still think that squishes and uh squishmallows are basically the same thing i just think i slightly prefer squishes also just because the company is better than 
squish mellow but out of all my mulchy plush i find my japanese ones are the best they have the best squish but i did not get this for the squish i got this because it's cute look at it so this is everyone that came in my builder bear order apart from you he's old well not old but you know he's not he didn't come in this order i'm sorry jacko i have so many little halloween plushies on my bed right now oh and i realized that of course i can hang my bat up here because he shouldn't be hanging by his head bats hang upside down so he's actually hanging by his butt tag and it's amazing people keep asking me about these macrame hangers as well i ordered some off of amazon and some off of aliexpress i just put in like macrame plush hanger and they come up and you can get them in single tiers two tiers or three tiers so this is the triple tier that i have i think i've seen a four tier one once but not often so because i want them all to kind of be co like cohesive around the room i've just gone with the triple tiers for everything they can hold six builder bears each so yeah i got a bunch of halloween stuff around i need to find a little place to put um skelly dog down because i kind of do want the halloween wants to be visible during the spookier months and why not start now there we go let's get your dog gang up there spooky paws is over there she does need to have somewhere where she can stand so she's not gonna be able to be visible most of the time but i'm gonna go now and i will record some footage of these in the dark obviously this doesn't glow this doesn't do anything in the dark this is just squishy cuteness but um i'm pretty sure this doesn't glow but these two should and i will definitely show you them glowing when the sun goes down anyway i hope you have a nice day i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please drop me a like below or i could do with some nicknames for the or not nicknames actual names for the gl axel glotal so if you have any ideas so i can fill out the birth certificate let me know same for pumpkin kitty that also needs a name but then again i am contemplating gifting that to my daughter as well so then we'll stick with the glotal we'll stick with the glotal leave me name suggestions for the axel axel glotal <laughs> it's hard to say and if you really like the video if you made it all the way to the end please consider subscribing i am trying to get to 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year and I'm going to love you and leave you. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you again soon. Bye. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, yeah. Finally. She's going a tiny bit.